here we are, day two. We're off to this labyrinth that's not too far away, by all accounts, and then we are going down to the beach. Not bad weather-wise. Not bad at all. I'm uh, in charge of directions today, and we've ended up in a desert, so I'm sure we'll be fine. We've got water packed, and uh, hopefully we won't get lost. Look at those views. Very pretty. Anyway, keep going. I always say people, no walk is complete without a camel. <laughs> there we are. Camel just chilling out over there. And we're heading towards the mountains. We feel a bit windy, but the good thing is, it's warm. Well, it's not just warm, it's hot. It's the wind is lovely. Well, we're still out in the desert. Can you hear that? It sounds like peacocks, a little bit of an oasis over there. But most of it's barren. T-shirt's off now because it's just so hot. The wind is lovely. And there's the sea, very pretty. We've come across a camp, somewhere to do a bit of camping if you wish. But we're looking for the Labyrintho. And we find the sign down there. Labyrintho, so straight on. Yeah, no drones or explosions, it's say. Okay, we won't. Oh man, it's hot. Not that I'm complaining, but it is hot. I guess this is not quite what I had in mind. Thought it would be higher. There's the center, but we're following it. Um, oh man, it takes you all the way around. You couldn't just literally step over this, but we're going to follow it. It's going to take us all the way out, I reckon. Now, I don't think this is a good idea, following all this. I think I'm just going to cheat. Done. Woohoo! Made it. Somehow, a collection of stones just randomly put themselves together to make out JW.org. Now, if you think that's impossible, stones cannot collect together like that. Well, therefore, I'd suggest you study the you evolutionists out there. Study the DNA strand and ask yourself, how on earth did that come together? I rest my case. We found the sea, and we're going to see if we can get a winding path down somewhere. I'm going to have some lunch right next to the sea, because that looks stunning. Although, the clouds up there look a bit darker. It's still baking hot, though. We shall see. We made it. Look how dark it looks out there. It looks like it's going to be... Um, rain might be then over there looks lovely but the sea oh it looks so good so inviting uh, a good sized beach here as well oh that does look lovely we're gonna have some sandwiches here and maybe a dip in the sea here we go then we're gonna go for our first little walk in the sea Wonder how cold it's gonna be. Here we go. Ah, oh, that's good. Oh, that's quite nice. That is quite delightful. Woo. Oh, lovely. Well, we're making our way back into the town now. We're gonna pick up some stuff for a barbecue tonight. Not much has happened differently out there. It still looks dark. Sun coming through over there and white clouds over there, but it's still hot. So it may rain, I'm not sure. Anyway, it's warmer than home, that's for sure. Don't get to do this at the moment. Well, you can, but it's a lot colder. <laughs> I should have done the video before, really, but I had a Bailey's Macchiato. So we had a cup of tea. Ruth had a, what, what, a chai latte, and Mike had a Coke. And that's our view. You can see the sea from here, it's not bad, is it? Well, we've just been to Super Dino, the supermarket, and I've got some octopus tentacles to put on the barbecue later. I can see the weather's got a lot better, a lot lighter. And uh, we're probably about a mile from home now. We've done a fair bit of walking today. I reckon seven, eight miles maybe, but look at the views over there, the little mountains. Beautiful, aren't they? Anyway, on the way home. We are back. Oh, 
I'm going to split them. And been, how far is it, Sue? Seven and a half. Seven and a half miles. Time for a chill now. And then, uh, oh, look at that cat to greet us as well in jacuzzi. So this is the barbecue. Oh, here it is. And I've got my octopus on there. I don't know if you can see that. But there's burgers and octopus on there. Oh, just a beautiful evening. Beautiful evening. And look at the cats. <laughs> One, two, three. I think this is the owner's uh, cats that come round. They think they're getting something. But, um, so love it, done it. Mike has cooked the octopus. He's confident it's cooked. If you don't see me tomorrow, guys, you'll know that... Yeah, let's get off, mate. You'll know that it wasn't, and I didn't survive. There's the octopus. Oh, ho, ho. Now, I know most of you are looking at it and going, disgusting. I love it. I love a bit of tentacle. Can't beat it. So Mike, bless him, has done all the barbecuing. we got our burgers and sausages and chicken and octopus, and nachos and onions and paella and salad. And we're sat in our open-air courtyard. Look at this. Beautiful evening. Very much looking forward to eating. Yum, 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 yum. Nom, 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 nom. Lauren, I'm confused as to why you need the heating on the house because we're eating outside at the moment. Um, is it not very warm where you are or something? Because... <laughs> We're very warm here, so I'm confused.